Hi, this is Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, right back here on Wager Talk TV with a free baseball video for you with two free plays for Thursday night's national TV game on ESPN, Thursday night, July 1st. Side in totals, they were both just a bit outside from being official best bets tonight. I'd still treat them as 1% to 2% opinion plays. This is the game between the Giants and Diamondbacks at 940 Eastern Thursday night on ESPN National TV. I'm going to give you a free side and total for this national TV game tonight in just a moment, right here on this video. Hey, a quick reminder, if you want my two official best bets tonight, they come in Major League Baseball and NBA playoff action. Two strong 4% best bets. We won again last night. I've now cashed 10 of the past 13 days at wagertalk.com on a current 20-8 and eight hot streak the past two weeks in baseball and basketball combined. Longer term, now 22-12 and 12 this month in baseball, 38-21 and 21 in the NBA the past two months. Isn't it a great time to become a direct subscriber? Isn't it time to save big and win big at the same time with a direct subscription? And now's the time to do it because I have a very special promo code for this video, Steve150, Steve150. Steve150 gets you a $150 discount on either a 30-day or 90-day all-access subscription on my page, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com. Hey, get the entire month of July to get the next 30 days of baseball and basketball or get the next three months, July, August, and September. And you know, right, that gives you a full month of college and pro football through September as well. So whether you choose the 30-day or the 90-day, you get a $150 discount with promo code Steve150 right now at wagertalk.com. Hey, let's get to both a side and total that were just a bit outside from being best bets tonight. And that comes in your 940 Eastern Thursday night game on ESPN National TV Action in Baseball tonight. Giants at the Diamondbacks. I'm going to side towards both the Diamondbacks as a home dog and also the under nine in this game. And here's the reason. You know, earlier this week on Tuesday, a couple days ago, I did my appearance on Wager Talk today. I mentioned as one of the games I covered there that it looked like the Baltimore Orioles were heating up after an unbelievable 20 straight road losses. They'd snapped that, started to play better offensively. And it also, more importantly, looked like the Houston Astros were cooling off after their monster run. Well, the Orioles won outright three straight games as over a 250 dog. Astros lost three straight the last three nights as over a $3 favorite. The reason I bring that up is because I think the Giants could also be cooling off now. The Giants are a team that has vastly overachieved this season. You know, when the season began, the Dodgers and the Padres were the two favorites to win the World Series in this same division, yet the Giants have been ahead of both of them all season long. Now, look, the Giants are a legitimate winning team. They have a plus over a plus 90 run differential for the season. It's a legitimate record. But you always look for a catalyst for teams to start to cool off. And I think it happened last week when their first baseman, Brandon Belt, went to the injured list. He was third on the team in home runs this season, and the offense has really struggled since. In fact, if you look here over the past week or so, they have now had single-digit hits in four of their last five games. More specifically, they've had six hits or less in three of those last five games. They just got swept by three games against the Dodgers, and it wasn't the pitching problem. In fact, the Giants held the Dodgers um, to eight hits or less in all three of those games, uh, all two games, rather. The problem five hits and three hits. The problem was that the Giants couldn't hit the ball any better. Um, and that's the thing here. Their offense has definitely cooled off. They've had two runs or less in all three straight games, three straight losses. In fact, over their last five games, they've now scored two runs or less in four of those five. And once again, that coincides to losing one of their best power hitters in first baseman belt. Uh, so once again, I'm going to lean towards the Diamondbacks here at plus money. We get Merrill Kelly on the mound. who has been a solid starter this year. His ERA is not great overall. Uh, but his whip is exactly the same as Cueto, who's been much weaker on the road. So we have both starters with the 1.3 whip. Um, Arizona's ballpark has been hitter friendly, of course, over the years. But Arizona's offense is struggling as well. They've had eight hits or less now in four straight games. After they snapped that record, 24 straight road losses, the most since 1900 by any team. Uh, they've come back and lost four straight, and they've scored four runs or less in all four. So once again, it's always bold to take one of the worst teams in baseball here. So we're going to take a little bit of a flyer with a free underdog for you, the Arizona Diamondbacks, plus $1.30. We'll play that action, by the way. This is more of a play against the Giants. And we'll hedge it a little bit with the under. Uh, the Giants' offense has struggled, and so has the D-backs. So if Arizona doesn't get there, I think the under cashes. So under 9, minus 115 as well is worth a look. So once again, Arizona Diamondbacks, plus 130 action, and under 9, minus $1.15, Cueto and Kelly. That goes at 9.40 Eastern Thursday night on ESPN National TV. Diamondbacks in the under, a couple opinions for you, 1% to 2% opinions that were just a bit outside from being official best bets on Thursday night. Hey, two games that weren't just a bit outside, two strong 4% best bets. We cashed again last night on a 20-8 and eight run the past two weeks, all sports. Get a 4% best bet in baseball tonight, an easy over slugfest that's going to soar over the total. And also game five between the Hawks and Bucks, a strong 4% best bet in the NBA. Once again, NBA 
on a fantastic run, 38 and 21 the past couple months. Baseball, 22 and 12 this month. All sports has over a 70% return on investment the past two months. Isn't it time you became part of that with a direct subscription? Cost of investment's never been lower. The time's never been better. It's July 1st. It's a new month. Make that commitment tonight. Get a 30-day all-access or a 90-day all-access and save $150 with promo code STEVE150. STEVE150. STEVE150 gets you $150 off a 30- or 90-day all-sports package. Right now, Steve Merrill, wagertalk.com, promo code STEVE150. Thanks for watching. As always, subscribe to Wager Talk TV. Give this video a thumbs up, like, and most importantly, comment below. Let me know your thoughts and who you like tonight in Major League Baseball on Thursday. I read all the comments. I love the support. I love the feedback. Smartest viewers on all of betting TV right here on Wager Talk TV. Hey, don't forget also to check out the daily shows on Friday, MLB First Pitch, Wager Talk Today as well. I'll be appearing both of those on Friday. And check back here all week long for great free contents and videos right here on Wager Talk TV. Best of luck tonight. I'll talk to you again soon.